In this paper, we propose sub-editors of representation for editing the BSSRDF of heterogeneous subsurface scattering acquired from real-world samples. Here we show a Buddha model rendered with the BSSRDF of the yellow wax sample shown at the bottom left. With our representation, artists can easily manipulate the scattering range, paint new materials, and apply other complex operations to generate the convincing heterogeneous subsurface scattering effects. The BSSRDF of a material encodes the light transport between surface points. This non-local effect poses two challenges in BSSRDF editing. First, it is difficult for artists to manipulate the appearance of a single surface location. Second, the non-local consistency of the BSSRDF function should be maintained to avoid the rendering artifact. Here we show the subsurface scattering of a marble chessboard, which is directly edited from the raw BSSRDF data. The consistency of the subsurface scattering between different points is destroyed and causes a visual artifact. With our representation, users can easily edit the local scattering effects and generate consistent subsurface scattering effects. We perform a side-by-side -side comparison here again. The key to our representation is the decoupling of the subsurface scattering between two points as a product of two 1D radial scattering profiles, centered around the entrance and exit points. Each scattering profile well captures the local scattering behavior. The appearance consistency of the resultant BSSRDF is ensured by our representation. Please see our paper for details. For intuitive editing, we further reparameterize the scattering profile as albedo, scattering range, and profile shapes. As shown here, editing the albedo alters the color. The scattering range controls the translucency of each point. While the profile shape adjusts the texture details within the scattering range. Combined with efficient selection and more complex editing operations, our representation allows users to easily edit the subsurface scattering effects with interactive feedback. The edited result can then be mapped to different geometries for rendering. Now we display some of our editing results. First we show an elephant rendered with wax material measured from the sample shown at the bottom left. The scattering range of the white region is then modified. Progressive variation in the edited subsurface scattering is well preserved. Here we copy a pattern onto the elephant body. The sharp variation of the subsurface scattering in the edited region is well rendered under the different lighting and viewing directions. In this example, the dragon is rendered with the stone material. With subedit, the heterogeneity of the measured stone material is easily enhanced or reduced and generates convincing subsurface scattering effects. Here we show a statue rendered with measured jade material. We blend the jade materials with measured yellow wax. With different blending weights and spatial variations, the resulting BSSRDF exhibits realistic subsurface scattering effects. The transition between both materials is automatically dealt with by our representation. With subedit, we can hallucinate a completely new BSSRDF from a single photograph of a translucent material sample, plus a different measured BSSRDF dataset. As shown here, the user only needs to copy scattering profiles from the measured yellow wax BSSRDF dataset and assign these to a few representative surface patches. The system automatically propagates the scattering profile to the whole image and generates a completely new BSSRDF. The rendering result of the hallucinated BSSRDF is plausible and artifact-free. Finally, we show another hallucination result. Here, the BSSRDF is hallucinated from the jade material in the input image shown at the bottom left. Although the albedo of the new jade material is totally different from the measured jade material, the hallucinated BSSRDF generates visually pleasing rendering results.